championship event, the uh, qualifier event. So, yeah, kind of glad I waited a couple days. Uh, so, but yeah, yeah, didn't do too much over the weekend. Just kind of, you know, uh, did some stuff for YouTube and catch up on. And there's still.
but uh, as far as what the hell are we going to be rolling with today, um, yeah, I think I'll start with the counter crew did, because like one of the heroes is just like a link summon, you know, three or four times, so we'll start with the counter crew deck. I probably will switch to the, uh, Basically, after we accomplish the dailies, uh, <laughs> I don't know the the phenomenon deck is just it just seems really fun. I, I don't know what it is, but it, it just does. It appeals to me right now. So, all right, we got mixer. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna move mute Chrome here, and I'm gonna mute. Championship 2023. Ooh. Ooh, I'm gonna say. Um, hmm. Let's just, uh, <laughs> I'm actually just gonna set solid. Bad. Like, yep, Zapion goes a back row deck and Wing Dragon of Raw Sphere mode. But, uh, not much else. So, we'll do that. We'll just sit on a solemn here. So, yeah. Pretty, pretty interesting person. The only reason I played the Sanct Sanctum there is to protect the uh, solemn. Well, this is probably Fu on the Reeds. Usually, if you see Pot of Duality, uh, it is food, so, because they, they can all make a bunch of beer birds. <laughs> You're not going to do that against my deck. Well, maybe. But it's just like, tuned. Okay. They could just keep them in their deck out, I doubt it's actually. Yeah, there are some good tune cards to search for, though. Like, if you're running trade-in, you know, you get tuned to what? Oh, maybe it is. Wow, they got two teams. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Alright. And bookmark, uh, let me see. Bookmark. Soon World would be destroyed by a card effect you can banish it instead. Oh, no, interesting. Well, instead, what if I use that to spin it to the dead? Shuffle all spells and capture one of the into the deck. That's technically not destroying, so, uh. This could be an interesting turn. First, let's see here. Tune Harpulate. Yeah. Okay. Uh, wait, why didn't he use the effect here? Now attack the turn to summon. If you control two worlds, you can special summon this card from your hand. And oh, you need another two monsters to destroy the ball of crap. Okay, I understand. I understand your terms and conditions. We'll just play you back in the What is that? If you control two worlds. Oh, he's playing this because he doesn't want to find it. Uh, that's fine. 
go ahead and proceed. Team Page Clip. Red Eye. ELS and Dark Magician Girl. If I could actually see these face up, I'd choose Dark Magician Girl, but I don't have a choice here. Oh wow, that's the worst one. <laughs> Um, yeah, that is pretty darn good there, buddy. Once per turn, banish your card. That is pretty good. Alrighty. Well, we'll just uh, zap Yon into two Harpy ladies. And we got Solomon, so I'm pretty sure this one works, but uh, yeah. Go zap Yon. Yeah, spin that back row. Here we go. Okay. And that's it. Alright. Yeah, tunes are pretty interesting though. He controlled Toon Girl. So he does have to control Toon Girl, I guess. But, uh, I mean, that's still a pretty good effect. Toon BLS. That is pretty good. Well, you can get Toon What? Normal Summoning Ash? Oh, that's never a good sign. That's never a good sign. I'm guessing they're gonna sink her or something. The yeah, ash is in tune. So okay. plus seven plus seven. Does this search like a field card or something? After a field card that was activated this turn, draw one card. Once per turn you can target a base up attack condition monster. Well, there is no good spell, so... Hmm. Since he's got one in hand, I mean, that just tells me he has one in hand, I guess. But, uh... I mean... I guess this is the, uh... <laughs> the unerotted ancient fairy dragon? Basically. That's basically what that is. And... It's crazy that uh, out of all the signer dragons, ancient fairy dragons, <laughs> they got banned. I would have thought that uh, Black Rose Dragon could have been banned at some point. At some point, but no. Alright, and we know his last card in his hand is Nibiru, right? Because he searched it. Yeah, man, that's crazy. Yeah, that's funny. We know the last card in his hand, so... Interesting. Yeah, because he searched it with uh, Duality, you know? Okay. Oh, this still is going okay, I guess. Uh, we could definitely use some better cards here ourselves. I mean, I guess I'll set Venus, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> we, we don't have much going on here. Uh, I actually have a... I guess he wants to protect it with the 3,000 defense, but uh, oh man, <laughs> oh we're breaking so hard right now, so so hard. I, uh, you got me. I'll pass. <laughs> oh man, this is uh, this is not an ideal first duel, so. and it he just so happens to be sending on two monsters instead of three. That's uh, man. Well, it's all good. We just need to duel uh, 20 times in here and get, get in some of those free games, so. Doesn't really matter if you win or lose, so. Uh, yeah, we've seen better days as far as our girls go. <laughs> there you
Well, I'll tell you what. I don't know. Maybe he'll be like too scared. He'll attack with BLS. I guess we'll set this. Uh, yeah, maybe this is level one. So down he can't help us here either. But I mean, maybe, maybe if we're lucky, we'll hold on another turn. Like that's best case scenario. He keeps doing nothing. He attacks with BLS and then attacks us directly. And maybe next turn if we do reversal quiz. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, that's game, boys and girls. Yeah. Like I said, if I could... Basically, we chose one. <laughs> we gave him two BLS, so... But, man, our hand right there... Diddly. That wasn't too fun, but let's do another one. Yeah, this deck can brick. This deck can brick, though. Like, really, 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 obviously. Because you guys see that, like, I am running, like, you know, three Mystic Shine Ball, and yeah, Master Duel does love to control you sometimes. And no lie, like, when I'm playing this deck myself, there have been, like, in fact, when I was doing one daily in the last two or three days, there's been something in the <laughs> Like, I swear, I drew all three Mystic Shine Ball. And then I drew like, I drew, you know, I drew, yeah, yeah, I drew like one black minute, and I drew Ash, and I was just like, oh my god. Like, even this hand is, I mean, it's it's alright, you know, it's, it's okay, but like, uh, yeah, yikes. This hand's not too good at either. I mean, I mean, we'll still play it out, but. Chain better days there. Scar. Hmm. There was actually like a a GX uh, anime only uh, archetype. Yeah, I guess it was an archetype. It was like um yeah, it was played by Professor Stein, and it was like the uh, Scar Knight. Was it Scab Knight Scarab or was it Scar Knight? No, no, I, I think there were two forms. Yeah, Scab Knight Scarab could like steal your opponent's monsters, and it was like a zero zero monster, and so. Uh, so Professor Stein kept uh, stealing uh, Jaden's uh, Neo Spatian in the field. It's pretty interesting. I don't think he's ever released that archetype yet. So. But uh, I don't know, that's just what I thought of when I saw Scar. Uh, I could ash that, but no. No, we'll, we'll ash something. I mean, maybe I should have ashed it, I don't know. Well, I feel like we can ash something better. Gym Knight? Wow. I've ever gold against Gym Knight. Like, ever. Terraforming. I mean, I could Ash that too, but we do have MST, so... Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Let it go through. Black Garden? Okay, this guy's picking up something interesting. Let's just say. Black Garden's an interesting webgate. I mean, I could Ash this. I mean, I could MST it. But, uh... No, no, we'll just, uh, we'll just let him keep it. I mean, Black Garden gives us free tokens, so, I mean, yeah, I don't really see the point in Ash's hand. This card is just the grave, though, right? Let a card effect target a normal match to the end. I don't know, maybe this is some kind of OTK, and I should have MST Black Garden, but, uh, Honestly, we weren't sitting on much, so I feel like free stuff is good. Your opponent controls a monster. Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe I should have. You can discard, set one fusion. Okay. So he's going to set, uh, I'm guessing, Gym Knight? Yeah, I know how this deck works. <laughs> but since you just said that, I will flatly MST it. Bye bye, Gym Knight fusion. We don't even want to let him activate it. Stuff to the graveyard upon activation. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. So. That was definitely a good hit. A good hit for us. So, what is that? Scatter fusion. What the hell? During your main phase, your opponent controls a monster. Oh, I see. But this says using monster from your deck as material. Well, we don't want that either, so I'm gonna solve that. Wow, he had two Gym Knight Fusion cards. Okay. Well, that's all the interaction I have. 
so if he's got one last Gym Knight Fusion card, then uh, he's good to go. Wait, could I bash that? Because it does say from the... Yeah, I don't know if I could have bashed that or not. Uh, no, because it's going to be special. And what is this? Phantom Force. Okay. You can add one Gym Knight card from your deck to your hand. Sounds like a good thing to ash to me. Alright, we got that called by a star. Man, this has been an interesting turn, I tell you what. Oh, he does! He does have called by. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Man, that this has been a crazy duel, I tell you. Very crazy. Man. So he give us keep his brilliant fusion, solemn his uh his other scatter fusion. And we tried to ash the corpse, because I'm sure this is gonna be just um brilliant fusion, but uh yeah, Gym Knight Fusion. Okay, I, I mean, close enough. Crazy, crazy duel. Wow. So I'm paying a thousand. Fusion Summon one. Yeah. Hmm. Yep. Not too good. Hmm. I'm guessing he's gonna go for Seraphim. Or maybe Lapis It is Lapis Lady Okay. I forget what this card does. I just all I know is it's a pretty good darn good card. Okay. For turn you can send a gym knight from your main deck or extra deck. Oh, <laughs> oh man, and uh, he spawned all these, these tokens on the field. That's going to be a lot of damage. Okay, so yeah, this is... I guess I should have hit uh, Black Garden after all. Well, now I know, but it's a little too late. Uh, all he needs to do is use uh, Loki Lee again. He's good to go. That's crazy. I'm pretty sure that's a soft one for turn two. Yeah, it's a soft, so... Wow, that is nuts. That's okay. Or just do uh, 1500 damage. Hard to kill here. I'm about to kill. Zerk. Um, don't know why he did that. Oh, that's it? Okay. Well, I guess he just needs to burn us again. Uh, Lapis will do the or Lady will do the, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I guess I'll set the, yeah, Divine Punishment here. Interesting. He's got 2,500 defense. That's pretty exciting for, uh, yeah. Okay, one card. Yeah, how all the attack hmm, to their opponent's field. Well, I think we have to work around here because let me just see here as far as my extra deck goes. Okay, yeah, so we can link spider. Obviously this is gonna give him some rose tokens as well. I think we have the work around because we have DLS. I'm pretty sure it's not good. So we'll spider. Uh, right here. But yeah, because all these tokens have only 800 attack. So, I'm pretty sure this is what I'm What I. is like the best case scenario for me to do here. Uh, for Masquerina. Basically, we're just gonna attack into our Rose token and use the attack game effect. And we're just gonna bank on DLS here. Uh, right here. I am giving him a bunch of link material too, which kind of does scare me, but uh, I think this is the best thing we can do. I mean, we didn't really draw any monsters or anything, but, you know. So. Alright, DLS, here we go. Lock up the soldier, soldier of chaos. There we go. Alright, and it 
does go down, but uh, we'll bring it back up to 3,000. Crash into a roast. There we go. Use the attack game effect. And now he's got a bunch of targets for us as well that we can uh, potentially use BLS's effect. So I feel pretty good about this. Back up the base attack. Have the protection of Masquerina. Seems like a good idea to me. I, I mean, I guess he could play BLS too. That's something to consider. But, uh, yeah, you know. Oh, nice. Got the other Gym Knight Lapis. Oh! Right, he can always just spawn tokens on my field as well. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Yeah, this is... Could potentially be the last turn here. We do just have this sitting out attack mode. Okay, Link in. Once again for the uh, Gym Knight. I would get. Yeah, Phantom Sport. Okay. And I don't think I want him to add anything, so let's, uh, let's Divine Punishment that. I know he added, like, the Gym Knight card, but uh, I think I want a Punishment. See, look, we just don't want to snow that's a snowball out of control for Phantom Sports. So. I think this skill does end the game, though, if he gets, uh... Wait, what happened? He brought something back. Oh, he brought back, uh... How did he do that? Oh, he used the other effect of that? Oh, he did, yeah. Target one monster. Oh, it doesn't have to... Dude, I thought Black Garden had to revive a plant monster. No, it just lets you target anything. Okay, if we can draw a black pin in here, to be potentially hilarious. No. Although, that's not too bad of a draw either. Hmm. Okay, so with her, I can get out Master Hyperion out here. Which, honestly, isn't too bad. What's this thing do with it? Right, right. Okay. Yeah, I guess let's get out of uh, Earth. Because we know the, the last card in his hand is like a good night or whatever. So, let's grab Master Hyperion, huh? which we can do since we've got Sanctuary Sky Elf. Um, yeah, I guess I'll special summon this. Yeah, I have to banish Earth, which not what you normally want to do, but let's take it. A little extra damage. And here we go. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Now, which effect should I give the LS? Well, either way, I can't win this turn. Maybe I should give it an extra attack. Now, nah, we'll, we'll go with the attack first. Yeah. And I carry on. And that's our turn. Crazy. Yeah. Never dueled against Gym Knights before, but uh, I mean, they seem pretty good. I mean, they're Link Monster. Uh, this? Yeah, Phantom Quartz seems really, really good. So, for what it's worth. Vanish for free. Oh, did he get Block Dragon? Yeah, you, that, that does make a lot of sense in this deck, to be quite honest. Yeah, it makes quite a lot of sense. That's it. Huh. Well, we need a monster here. That is not a monster. I guess it does help, but uh, hmm, good thing I did the attack too. I forget what block dragon does. Set by battle. If since the graveyard can have three, oh man, that's not good. Yeah, whose total level is eight? Man. If I had a way to pop this, I definitely would, but, uh, Master Hyperion, but I can't, I don't have any, uh, I don't have any fairies in three, what kind of link? This? Vanish all cards on the field. 
but that would include myself. Yeah, I mean, man. Yep, this sucks, but uh, really no other way past it, I guess. So, I mean, if I could damage block dragon, I definitely would, but uh, unfortunately I cannot. So, I guess we'll go for the second attack, and he's gonna use the effect now. I mean, his total levels equal eight. Yeah, some Gym Knight monsters have a pretty low level, so he could probably add like two or three monsters to his hand. Maybe even more. That's crazy. Yeah. Top set the Block Dragon, yeah, so there's one, three, there's a two, and here comes a... Yeah, pretty good, pretty good. Unfortunately, that's gonna be it for me. Yeah. I'm pretty sure next turn you can just combo, you know, Resurrect Block Dragon, and then, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's going to be it, man. Block Dragon combos are pretty powerful. Armadillo? Pretty good, pretty good. Port. Yep. Well, he's getting into the main combo of the deck now. Better people. Yeah. Well, I kind of feel like we have to solve this. It doesn't feel too good because I know he can bring back back block dragon, but uh, yeah, I kind of feel like I have to solve that. I really don't have a choice because uh, he's only played two lapis. Uh, so he brings out the third, that's just game over. So that's right. I'm pretty sure you can still like do 250 to master Hyperion though. That seems pretty easy to do. So but yeah, had to do it though. Yep. Yep, yep. And there goes research. Yeah, that'll probably do it. That was a good game though. I try. <laughs> Pretty interesting deck, though, I will say. That'll make for some good highlights on uh, YouTube over there. Probably one of the more interesting... I mean, because I know people have to go... I remember it used to be really, really, really popular because of this card right here. Good night, dude. But, yeah. Then you can get... So I just need one more spell card. And then I'll probably switch back over to the uh to the Venom Deck. Man, that's crazy. We were at like 500 life points for two or three turns there too. I just didn't have the uh black pennant. But I was sitting on the two reversal quiz. That would have been pretty funny. And he didn't have any negation up either. So that's the one thing I noticed about his deck. Uh, as interesting as it was, didn't have too much negation up, so... Yeah, pretty interesting, though. I guess you don't need too much uh, negation out, though, when your main goal is uh, burn. You have to win via burn. You don't really need uh, too much negation now, so... But I did miss streaming this, it's just, you know. But at the same time, it did feel pretty good to, you know, take a break from uh, Master Goal for a couple of days. Oh, well, like I said, I didn't take a break. I did the daily, but that was good. It did feel good to, you know, take a break from streaming.
okay. <laughs> cool stuff. St
Wow, we only need to do 800. That's interesting. Okay. And I guess I will shotgun. Yeah, Fallen Sanctuary again. Get some negation out here. Cool. That's uh, Divine Punishment. I do like uh, the fact that uh, this deck does run a couple counter traps, though. That does great things. Draining Shield, though. Draining Shield, that, <laughs> that one surprised me. That one surprised me, uh, bro. <laughs> oh, man. That monster. That's it. Okay. I think that's gonna end the duel. I guess he bricked. Dark Ruler no more. We don't even need that. Um, yeah, I guess let's just uh, shine ball that away. I guess. Hi. Nope. Don't change anything. There's Cobra. Okay. Well, I'm not sure what his strategy was, but, um, whatever. I guess we'll just kinda, kinda be in here a little bit. I'll take her. We'll bring out the big boy if he lets us. Um, here we go. Mm. Nope. Earth, I'll take Pluto. Let's bring the big boy out here, why not? Master player Hyperion, you're up. Yeah, not too often I get to summon this monster. But it is the main goal of the day, so I'm not even gonna use the copy of this, I just wanna just get out of here. There you go, Master Player. You get some time, some screen time, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's just a battle here. There we go. Well, that was, uh, uh, bro over here bricked. We got lucky. This is, uh, it looked like he was running some kind of Gradle deck. Gradle's like to take a soul to your opponent's mock card, so that's interesting. He might have been cooking up something there pretty cool there, but we'll never know now. Uh,. Okay, stream still looks good. And we've been going... Oh, not even an hour. Okay. Um, it just hit 11 here, 11 here. I'll probably just go to about midnight. First stream back like an hour and so. <laughs> I'm not even sure I can say this name on YouTube either. Um, <laughs> yeah, we're getting some funny names. I'm just gonna say purple. I'm not gonna say the first you know, letter. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, 42 card deck. 8 in the extra. Interesting. Okay, well, we got ready fusion. Uh, but, uh, we have a sword. Well, he said, uh, actually, we can protect our fun gates. Kind of, with a Sanctum. So I guess I'll play Sanctum, yeah. Even though I don't have any fairies here. And we'll set some pass. Yeah, because uh, this card is actually pretty good in other decks as well. Because it says set spells and traps. Can't be destroyed by card effects. That's actually pretty good, yeah. And you can just wait till they put out a monster and then let gate on, you know. Some people don't read and they'll just kind of lightning storm right away. Pretty interesting. Yeah? Okay. I wonder what kind of deck Kerp has here. Couple face down. Oh, wow. Alrighty. That's it? That's it? Wow. Okay. Maybe this guy brick too, I don't know. Uh, I guess I'll play this to take out, uh... Get Divine Punishment. I think that'll do it. Yeah, that's it. Alright. 
Oh, we didn't even need to play our floodgate. Ascended of Thunder, huh? Hmm. What? Let me think. You're level 7. Um. What does this say? Two fairies? Yeah, I thought so. Um. Yeah, well, we really don't have much else going on here, so I guess we'll play this. Yeah, for three grand. Normally, I like to play this, uh. <laughs> Basically, this is just BLS Climb Fodder, but uh, I guess it's going to be our main monster now. What is that? Uh, target one, spell trap, destroy it. Oh, he's going after this? Hmm. That's fine. I suppose. Although, I wonder how Paleo can play against this. Hmm. Probably not too good since they're all like level 2 offers. <laughs> okay. We might have like the perfect floodgate out here. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Although, I guess if he does have another. Oh, uh, oh, then uh, our floodgate is gone. So. There is that. Alright, Earth. What is this? Here. Oh, say it ain't so. Um, hmm. Go ahead. Go ahead. I mean, I guess I could have negated that, but I don't feel like I need to. But a tier element. Tier bricks. There ain't no way. This. Target a monster, destroy it. Okay. Well, that's just gonna replenish our life. So, <laughs> do I even want to negate that? I don't think I do. Okay. <laughs> that just gives us uh, 500,000 extra. So. Oh, but tier, 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 tier. Okay. I will end the turn here. Yep. Just like in the other streams, I'll show this duel against tier and uh, any other future decks of tier which you can. Huh. Yeah, tier with 8 in the extra deck. That is. Uh, I don't even know what to say about that. Um, tell you what. We'll wait. I was just gonna play this in standby, but no. We'll wait. Okay, yeah, now we'll play it. Merely. I could negate that as well, but, uh, yeah, we'll just play this. The band played on. Maybe he's using tier? I mean, there's a slim possibility, very slim, that he's playing tier as a, uh, paleo engine? But I doubt it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I highly doubt it. That he's using tier as a, you know, paleo engine, but, uh, seen crazier stuff, so. I think the converse is actually what's happening. He's using paleo, paleozoics as a tier. <laughs> That's much more likely. Nah, we're not gonna negate that either. We're not gonna negate that. Alright, and he got his Shuffler uh, in the grave, uh, Moodle. Monster Reborn. On my Ascended of Thunder? I guess that's what he's using that on. What else would you use it on here? Hey, what do you use it on? He used it on... He used it on something in his race. Oh, I'm guessing it's the level 3. Yeah, because that's the only possibility, right? On half? Yeah, okay. Yeah, because I was getting ready to say, like, what? 
Now that makes sense, though. That makes quite a lot of sense. Battle phase, that's it. You're not going to go into your tier elements. This is fusions. That's interesting. Okie dokie. Solemn? That's a little late there, buddy. Well, looks like we bridge boys and girls. So, that's it. I am my turn. Go ahead. Go ahead, Herb. Yep, I ain't got much yet. And I think all you need to do is switch this to attack mode. That's a, that's a 3,000. I don't know. We, we just have one more turn. <laughs> Yeah, why didn't you go into fusion, though? Odd. Just battling. Smart. Yep, no need to play anything. Yep. It's a good old nearly beatdown. I don't think it really matters too much, though. Okay. like the most chill uh tier elements duel I've ever had. I mean most of them were quite a while because they are always using like the deal effects and their fusion effects, but uh that one was pretty straightforward. You know that if if all tier tier elements duels were like that, I really wouldn't mind. But uh alas. Okay. And we'll check the dailies after this after this duel. And probably switch back to the Win to level up. Ah, we'll see. I'll try. Okay. 60s or so? I mean, not in the 60s. It was, it was more like in the 80s. I mean, 60s. That would be unheard of for this time of year, but... Yeah, not too bad of a uh, Let's see that in Soccer ball. That X or Mac or uh, Infirm. Oh, yeah, he's got something. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's got something. He's also a man. He's taking quite a while to think there. Alright, you'll get one free card. Um, usually, when I see Max C in this day, um, you know, I definitely don't shine ball all the way. I'll just basically, you know, as soon as they chain Max C, I'll just kind of stop. So, yep, that's it. Alrighty, over to you, soccer ball. That's it. Yeah, 
one free card. Very good. He, he timed it right, too. He waited until I actually activated uh, Venus. Some people, when they see, see me summon Venus, will just kind of shotgun Maxi. And, uh...
probably Golden Land forever. That's what I'm thinking. That is Hakier. Yeah, I think that was Hakiera. Yeah, I also just in attack mode now. What's he gonna go after? Venus, huh? <laughs> uh, what's funny is I could honest here, but I don't even have to. Um, that's fine. Uh, let's do honest though, just because I find it play. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> see ya. Didn't see that coming. Did soccer ball? <laughs> Good old honest. <laughs> oh man. Sure, main phase two, he'll use uh, Elvich's effect. So you know what? Maybe I should have left it on board, but it's all. So I think, uh, yeah, Elvich like actually resolves in the hand, which is nuts if you think about it. But um, that's another way to go about it. There you go. Very nice. Very nice. But oh, you just brought it right back. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Get a kaiju. Hmm. I actually don't think we can play this because it's a level. Oh no, no, it is level seven. Uh, I can use this effect though. Thirty-four sanctuary in the sky. Hmm. Okay. Uh, kaijuing the. Yeah, kaijuing the Elvish. Honestly, does in favor. Basically, it gives them more damage. On options here though. Um, when this is sent to the graveyard, yeah I get to draw a card. Let's just play this, yeah. I know we're missing out on the effect, but let's go ahead and play that, yeah. And yeah, we'll play Zephyron in the field spell we'll pass. Okie dokie. Yeah, I think Sucker Ball got this one up. Skill Drain, Skill Drain still is and will be a pretty good card. So we'll just try to hang on, see what I can do. Because we know he has like a, I think he has Conquistador. I'm gonna guess he has like at least two um, Elvish Trap Monsters face down. Or some other kind of floodgate, like summon them. <laughs> That's what I would expect, you know. But we'll see. Um, speaking of here, so let me just check on train here. Oh, you just passed. Wow. Okay. Well, um, Zapion's actually going to stay on board here. I wasn't counting on at all. Uh, yeah. This is under skill drain, so. Yep, that's negated. I guess we'll just switch to defense mode. <laughs> He's just gonna let us keep our monster. Um, I'll gladly keep it, man. <laughs> okay. 
weird decision, but he, he kind of gave us a homie drop there. I mean, I, I appreciate it, I guess. I mean, you can just attack it, though, bro. <laughs> if you want. I mean, that's, you know, if you want to let me keep it, that's cool. That, that is totally up to you, my friend. <laughs> that is your prerogative. So... I guess maybe he thinks if, uh... Well, I guess... That's a good question. If he destroys this by battle... I, I just thought about that myself. If I destroy this... If I destroyed myself by battle... Would it prod? I think it would. Because, um, it would be in the graveyard. Skill Dream can't negate in the graveyard, right? That's quite interesting. Maybe that's why he didn't attack it. I guess next turn I'll just throw myself in. Uh, if this card battles, yeah. Huh. Yeah, I just thought of that myself. Okay, uh, that's the game. Uh, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, Zafio kind of works different from most of the time it works. You know what, let me see if this works. I'm actually genuinely curious. Like, why he's not attacking? Is that why? Because, like, Skill Drain and his other cards will disappear. Uh-huh, so there's Zafio. So we get the draw. Battle phase, do all those cards disappear? No, yeah, I didn't think so. Like, yeah, this card has to. Uh, huh. I guess for the second effect, it has to be uh, face up. I didn't think that would work, but, uh, you know. Didn't hurt. Um, maybe next time I'll card it. Okay, I'll pass. I thought that would actually work for a second there, but no. Okay. We have nothing else, we got our free cards, so... Okay, and then you can banish a card from either graveyard. Alrighty. Uh-huh. Hop hero. Okay, so there goes the Time Lord. Yeah, I thought that would affect my prawn, but uh, well, at least at least now I know. For the uh, for the spin effects, uh, Zapion has to be on the field. <laughs> hey, go ahead and take another Eldritch. I mean, yeah, might as well. Yeah, go ahead. There you go. Brand infusion, nice. Very good. That's how you do it. Alright, so this should be the end of the game now. Doo -doo. Yeah, I don't know why he was holding back. I guess he thought what I thought as far as the Time Lord. That's why he wasn't attacking. But, uh, yeah, buddy, suck the ball. You could have done this like two or three turns ago. I'm just saying, cuz. I'm just saying. <laughs> Interesting. Well, it's good to know that's how that works, though. Because I might need to know, like, in another duel. So. Uh, let's go and like I said. Let's, uh, get whatever version that so far. Okay, okay.
yet. I think we I parked in the spot, but uh, just select this. Um, let me check it out. So I might have had some. Right, I think at one point I uh, had reduced Phenomenaga to one, and I'm getting here. Um, I forgot. Um, uh, I might have changed the texture to it too, that's okay. Let me see. Uh, okay, that's the thing. Okay. I can't. Okay. Uh, taking out the Gravity Clap strategy. Okay, yeah, let's take out Phenomenaga. This. Um, let's maybe take out the collapse for. Uh, I know what I hear. Uh, when in doubt, floodgates, I guess. The band. I actually like this card quite a lot. You'll see me playing it in a lot of decks in the band. I'll throw a compulsive here just because compulsory. I already have Lord, right? Uh, or I could put in a solemn judgment. Eh, we'll just do this for now. Okay, time to do They mill duster, so. Alright. White Swarm. Hmm. A pretty powerful deck, if I can say so myself. Yep, here comes Wolf. Uh, let's just go ahead and play this now. Crap here. Alrighty. The world is yours, Denny, though. You're free to do whatever. Wolf Light Sworn Beast. And they search for Raiden, so. They might go into Borlode. Well, if they were smart, they'd go into Borlode. Well, they'd, like, do a bunch of Link Tunnels. They'd go into Borlode. 
tier? What? A light sworn and tier element combo? There ain't no way, bro. There ain't no way. <laughs> That's clever. Well, I know I said I'd skip any other tier decks, but uh, I kind of just want to see how far this combo can go before we screw it. So, uh, wow, that is quite interesting. Tier elements and light support. That sounds potentially very, very disgusting combo wise. Alright. I'm going to let Dan Danilo, like, cook here. But uh, as soon as it hits our turn, I probably am going to see. I just want to see, like, how far can we go using light support combo. Well, that's pretty interesting. <laughs> Although, most light swarms will meal on the end phase, though, so... I don't know, yeah. I don't know if that's too smart of an engine to combine or not. I mean, probably, probably, you know. You do get some, you know, free meal for light, light swarms regardless. So, I don't know. It's probably a good idea. So... Okay. We got Trick Cloud now. Abyss Dweller, here we come. Oh, that's Minnoke, yeah. That makes sense as well, yeah. <laughs> did they kill another wolf? They did. Yeah. Wow. Pretty lucky. <laughs> They're running like Dangers, Mothman. <laughs> The Nilo is cooking something special over here, man. I tell you. Yep. He's got a uh, hat tricker in here, too. Yeah. <laughs> Stein. <laughs> oh, man. Yep. This is a pretty interesting deck, I tell you. Makes a lot of yep. Meal some more tier stuff. That's what they're hoping for. Or some more light sword stuff. I mean, you already milled two wolves, so that's. The Nemo is cooking. She's cooking. Let her cook. <laughs> oh boy. Lake Spreader is a good mill, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Oh, and they got the uh, Chaos Dragon bit up in here. That makes a lot of I mean, lights a lot of this easier. Or off yeah. I'm sure they'll, like, link off, uh, Chaos Ruler and use it again. Plague Spreader? Yeah, probably going back, like, uh, Barone, Defu, two and an eight. Yeah, that also works. They had a bunch of monsters on board, so why not? And some of them are free, like they got two free wolves, so yeah, why not? <laughs> okay. Alright. Everything's a little dark. Wow. Yeah, finish it, sure go. Then the cops. Another charge of the light brigade. <laughs> wow. Look how much of their deck they've been. That's <laughs> crazy. They'll bring back a uh, chaotic dragon at some point. 
Wow. Yeah, there, here it comes. Yep. Oh, it does. Oh, no, that was yeah, the other Valkyria. So, Valkyria will let them get, uh... Oh, it's in one light or dark monster from your deck graveyard. So they can send the third wolf if they want, or whatever else is good that they want in the graveyard. Mm -hmm. I see. Minerva? Or was it? No, that was light, though. That was light, light actually. Okay. Maybe now they'll go into Baron. Chaos Space! Banish this card from your graveyard. Part of your banished life or dark. I see. Place them on the bottom of the deck. Did they take back Lithium Eve? Yes, they did. <laughs> I think. Let's summon a monster from your hand. Sorry, you just hold your hand. So there's a uh, Lumina. Grab back any light sworn they want from the graveyard. I mean, I would guess Raiden, but uh, I don't know. It may do something I've never seen before. Oh, Lila, okay. I guess they're going after my rise. Oh no.
pretty sure we are. I didn't special something, so. Ba -da -bum -bum -bum. Oh, yeah. Alright. Um, what time are we at here? Oh, it's just right at midnight. Okay. That is about when I said I'd, I'd keep going to. Um, Let's see, that's like 137 right now. Yeah. yeah, maybe I'll just go like another 23 minutes, make it a full two hours for the VOD. And then we'll call it we'll call it a good stream. Magicians run this card a lot, though. Yeah, 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 it is right. 60 card Dark Magician. Alright. Well, at least they didn't play this with the Dark Magician, so that's, that's kind of good. That saves us a bit of uh, damage, I suppose. I mean, they still could OTK here, though, depending on what card they draw. Oh, 
Matsuka. Is that a royal? Legacy Archer? It looks pretty neat. Hmm. Soul Servant. Oh boy, well, now they can have Servo if they want it. All they have to do is add a. Uh, add a spin up. Oh, okay. I can see that. Mm -hmm. Alright, Satsu. Satsu is cooking. Does the draw effect once per turn? <laughs> that was a nice. Alright. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, yeah, we'll let him draw a card here. And I'll search for... Uh, which one should I search for? I suppose Nunu. -Nu. Yeah. It might not matter. He may be able to OTK though, because we get the next card. We'll see. What is she? Oh, uh, right. We have to discard to uh, let's put R on M3. Oh, yeah, you really might be able to OTK. You gave him Illusion of Chaos, or he had it in his hand the whole time. It's a thousand knives, though. <laughs> Alright, and with that, I think he can grab Circle. The, uh, Roth? Magician's Roth? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Magician's Roth. Or I guess he could take Eternal Soul, which is depends on what he wants. So he's got Sage's Stone. Star Magic and Carrot. Yeah, he could get enough damage on Ward here. Oh! Yeah, he is going to get enough damage. Yeah, Dark Magician Girl comes out, and he searched for Sage's Stone. Not bad. Dark Magician OTK, there you go. Yeah, because this is uh, 4,500. Plus 16 is, uh, 4,500, plus 16 is 6,100. Save your stone will be 8,600. Wow. <laughs> He's got the magic formula, too. Aw, oh, yeah. Aw, oh, yeah, baby. Wait, why didn't you play Save your stone, bro? Bro! Do you have only one Dark Magician? Why didn't he have two chaos? Oh, unless he's gonna play the fusion card, the quick card? From his hand. He didn't know TK. Come on, yo. Well, unfortunately for you, amigo, I drew the lightning storm, so, uh. We're just gonna play. This first? That's good. Wow. He really should have OTK this way. But okay. Yeah, he gained lightning. Uh, lightning Storm is next. Wow. Yeah, for the life of me, I don't know why he didn't OTK us there. Uh, let's send. Uh... Did I send Phenomenon? Sure. I do have Limit Reverse, so... Here's Sin Phenomenon. Okay, so we can Special Summon... Viper to Birth. Ooh, I can do that as well. Let's, uh... Let's just get Nayu, yes. Our new new out. And new new. Special Summon. And I have like the. Yeah, I have Zohai in the grave. So. I guess I'll get rid of Rebirth. Yeah. I'll get rid of Rebirth for Zohai. Zohai, come on. We'll set this reverse right here. Okay. And we'll search for King of the Heroes. Overlay network. And what should I grab? Hmm, based on what's in my graveyard. I 
guess I should grab, uh... Maybe I should grab Kotal here, actually. Catch new. Grab Kotal. Assuming he blesses us, anyway. Uh, Rotillion Kotal. Okay. Like special summon cult for the extra damage history. Well, no, I am only down to 1200, and they can get out of dark conditions pretty easily. We'll just do that, and that'll be the turn. Hmm. Okay, one, two, three reptiles in grave, and when these two go, I'll have five. I'm thinking about limit reverse here, so I'll have five for a phenomenon. Okay. You are turned that Oh, he still has that card in his hand. Smart. He kept it. He kept it when he searched for Magician's Rod. Very good. So he can get Dark Magician right in the house. Very, very good, Satsu. So yeah, here comes Dark Magician again. Hmm. He's got both hearts. Well, yeah, he still doesn't have Circle, like, that's the good part. Lady brought out Girl. Ah, oh, that, that does make sense, yeah. It has more attack points here, so... That makes a lot of sense. And he still has Sage of Stone, right. Hmm, okay. I think we should still be able to survive this turn. I'm guessing the last card in his hand is the Ritual card. So... What's he gonna attack with? Magician girl, huh? Okay, it's my own. Three hundred. Let me do my math check. One, two, three, four. Oh, right, because I'm taking one out of the grave. So, phenomenon will be down to uh, just two thousand, but I'll have enough to survive. So, I will drive phenomenon. There we go. It's not over yet, Satsu. That's very good. And we'll revive Phenomena with his own effect. Um, yeah, let's just finish uh, Feral Hills. Be reborn, Phenomena. Very good. Hmm, I could potentially summon DLS for protection here. That wouldn't be too bad. Hmm. Offerings to the snake deity. Okay. So I can special summon Kotal. And I can get out uh, Zohar, right? Yeah. For BLS. Hmm. Let me think about this. Well, I'm probably going to ditch uh, Offerings. It is, or should I? It has two cards right here on board. Yes, yeah, should I? Uh... I gotta actually think about this. Should I keep offering? Maybe I should, have, yeah. Let's get. Hope so. Actually. Summon Zohar. Offerings is actually a pretty good bet here. Uh, new new once again. Set offerings over here. Overlay for. I could do Echidna as well, but no. Well, overlay for. King of the Pharaoh Imps once again. Right here in the middle. Attack mode. Um, R run. I guess. Yeah, yeah. But no. Old King. Attach Nunu. -Nu. And we'll grab Kotal again. Probably, yeah. Yep, we'll grab. Actually, let's take 
stealth burst for this guy. He'll take stealth burst. And I think that'll do it. Yeah, that'll do it. Okay. Over to you, Satsu. Setting a pretty obvious trap here, but uh Yeah. Hmm. This plan is pretty uh, bad though if you drew the fusion card. <laughs> yeah, if he if he has the fusion card at any point, it's just like, oh boy. <laughs> we are screwed pretty hard. <laughs> Magician's rod. That's also not good. Quite honestly. Hmm. So is he finally gonna get circled? I mean, I would assume so. Mm -hmm. One would gather. Dark burning. Ooh. Okay. Interesting choice of a card to take there. I'll take this opportunity to play this now. Offering some snake baby. And I'll pop both of these, yeah. Yeah, I have to, because he, he showed me the card he searched there. <laughs> so, but if he has the quick play fusion, yeah, we are screwed. He can just basically dodge the effect. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, he can play it anyway. Nice. Nice. And yeah, well done. Yep. I didn't even realize that was a quick play. That was a good move, though. Pretty smart, yeah. Yeah, so I would have had to hit that search on... on Magician's Rod there. Yep. Nice duel. Alright, uh, what time are we here? Been streaming... Hour 52? Okay. This will be the last duel, unless they, like, scoop or something. Hi... 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 How would you say that? Hi... Again? Oh. I guess that's what I'm saying. Snake Crane first turn? You don't say. Okay. Let's play Snake Crane. Well, we got two Reborn cards, too. Um, I'm assuming this might get Ash, though, no? Well, we do have two Reborn cards, so I guess I'll send some stuff I want to be Reborn. Um, let's Reborn Night. Let's Reborn. Maybe Aura? Yeah, it kind of would be good to Reborn. Um, what else do I have one in the grave? Yeah. Hmm, I could go for the Alien Kid combo, which I actually kind of want to do. Or for the Mars combo. I could go for the Mars and Kid combo, actually, here. That looks pretty good. Now let's kill those cards. So, let's use Nunu, and I'll probably just steal the other Octo with that card. This right here. Or do I want Colt to engrave? Yeah, let's put Colt to engrave here. Okay, so let's, uh... Bring back new new. That makes sense. Okay. Rebirth on Nyuya. Nyuya. Here you are. Don't smoke. Nyuya search effect. Water lily. of the 
Feral Imps. So I've got two Reborn cards, so I just have to think here. Um, so I can just Reborn Kid and Mars. Call it a day. Um, should probably go into some extra deck stuff though, no? So we will King of the Feral Imps. There we go. Girl in. Search us another card. Um, these were both special summons, right? Like, I'm not tripping, right? And. Like, I'm not tripping. You can take this. Yeah, I'm not. Okay. So, Harmonite. Harmonite Events. Reborn. Kid. There we go. Um, I think what we want to do is go into the Reptilian card, actually. Um, for the combo? One. This one. Launchers your opponent control with A counters or change the defense can't use their effects. Yeah, I think they want this card out. Yep. Yeah. And then I'll bring back Kid and Mars. Yeah, I've never played this combo, so why not? There we go. Okay. <laughs> I'll try to go for the ultimate alien combo here, apparently. Zero all. Uh, effects. Right. So we can take a Stealth Burster, which I didn't have. Or Code A. Um, <laughs> maybe I should take this, actually. Let's take, uh... Let's take Planet Virus here. <laughs> Alright, set virus. Okay, we'll water Lily. I guess I'll get, uh... What else do I like in my graveyard here? I guess so high, yeah. Or Stealth Burst. Either one would be good. Uh, Stealth Burst for sure. In the grave, buddy. Special summon? Yeah. We want... Alien Kid out here. There you go. Alright. Stealth Burster can go off here. Now let's see. This is a uh, card your opponent controls, right? Yeah. Not so. Uh, so let's put this... Mars would, uh, I might have fluffed this up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I might have fluffed that up. Okay, we'll just put him, put him on here. And I think we want to pass with that. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That was my long first turn. Hike. Hike. Hike again. No, we're good. Dude. I got a lot of reptiles in the very first turn, though. Exodia? It's not possible. No one's ever been able to summon him. Oh, you know there's got to be some teams with this. It's a lens fighter? Oh, yeah, there's got to be some cheese with uh, normal summon Exodia. Uh, face down. Two face down. Three face down. <laughs> yeah, there's gotta be some cheese in this thing. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Um. 
No, we're good. We're good. Okay. Alrighty. New new. That's interesting. Alrighty. Okay, I think we'll start this turn off by, let's see, move two A counters, immediately normal summon a reptile. So we can grab an extra summon. I think we want to exchange Nunu for a Zoha. Oh, Zoha's not great. Hmm. Well, we could just use Stealth Burster to pop a uh, Link Rape over there. Uh, yeah, why is Zoha in the grave? I don't know. Um, let's send... Is Coastal in the graveyard? It is. Okay. But she's reborn on a Reptilian Coastal. Yeah, it works. Great, here. Hold by, I'm expecting. Oh no. Okay. We'll go for some protection here. Uh, normal summon here. And we will synchro summon into Reptilian. Where is she named? There we go. Synchro summon way over here. We still have the kid combo, so... We'll throw a kid into Link Free though there. No, we're not going to play with this. Alright, let's see what they do about this paladin. I mean, maybe I should have went to BLS, but yeah. we'll see. Okay. Looks like we're okay right now. They roll all. Get in there. Oh, still good. Okay. And never seen it. Go ahead. That turn went fine. Everything went better than expected. Alright, I am my turn. Hmm. Okay. Maybe we shut down their combo here? With the, uh, arrow all and kid combo. Or maybe not, I don't know. The good part is, if they're running standard Exodia, we do still have Virus here to, uh, try to pop the library. What in the world? Laundry? Laundry Dragon Maid. Huh. Okay. Interesting. And that was the normal summon, too. So it doesn't get an A counter. Ooh. Oh, I see. So this is like a branded combo here. Hmm. <laughs> I see. A branded kind of laundry dragon maid combo. Interesting. Okay. We got called by the grave. That's honestly pretty good. Just in case. Hmm. Well, let's just attack and see what happens here. Not using the effect, I guess I'll go in with Melusine. I mean, is this game? There's no way it is, right? You got four face downs, bro. What? What? What even happened there? What? I'm legitimately surprised we won that one. Like, how? Bro, what? I guess it is just Bluff City back there, man. They didn't have anything. Weird. Okay, well, guys, the, somehow we won that one. I, I don't know how, but uh, well, I guess that's going to do it. So we just need three more wins, and we get to the last three gems here. Three more wins and uh, 12 more duels. That'll probably take us a couple streams, but uh, oh, what's this? We got a life turn. Activate trap card. We activated 2,000 traps. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't know what happened on that last duel, man. <laughs> I thought it, they were going to have something, but I guess not. Well, um, anyways, for the uh, people watching on YouTube, this is going to be it for the stream. Appreciate you guys watching. Have a good night. Bye-bye. And I will see you guys all in the next
Phoenix tonight. All right. Uh, as far as what I have looked forward to, uh, not too much like, you know, uh, what you call it? Not too much news as far as like what's going to be coming up on YouTube. Uh, but I do plan to record some, uh, uh, just some music stuff tonight, like a DX Google Cat. And uh, I think some more Nightmare Troubadour. Yeah, probably. No, no, wait. No, I think uh, I got Nightmare Troubadour. Uh, forbidden memory. 